I'm Noelle Madison with Healthy Places blog, Living with Adult ADHD, and I want to talk about ADHD and ambition. I've linked my article about unfulfilled potential in ADHD in the description box because I feel as though the two subjects go hand in hand. Certainly not everyone with ADHD feels like they have unfulfilled potential. A lot of people wouldn't describe themselves as particularly ambitious because they have laid back personalities or because they feel quite discouraged about working towards any goal. Um, and also a lot of people seem to have fulfilled their potential. There are many famous people with ADHD, whether they're actors or artists, athletes or entrepreneurs. But I think a lot of people with ADHD are ambitious in the sense that we come up with so many ideas. It's part of what makes it hard for us to focus on one thing. We get distracted by new things which remind us of something else, which maybe will remind us of something else and something else and so on. So because of this, we can make some really interesting connections, which we certainly enjoy doing. And some people have suggested that the bigger the possibilities and the goals, the more exciting the ideas. Uh, but it is very difficult for us because of this um, difficulty regulating our attention to work towards those goals, at least in many cases. Uh, there's a Russell Barkley video, he's an ADHD expert that I link to in the article below, where he describes ADHD as being a cruise missile with a brilliant computer system and maybe even a specific target, but no fuel. I don't always feel like I have a brilliant computer system, but uh, many people with ADHD have a lot of abilities and then struggle with the follow through required to fully utilize those abilities. This may sound like a downer, but the good thing is that this is a symptom of ADHD rather than an insurmountable character flaw. It's a bit of a conundrum because ADHD might be pointing you to a goal and then blocking you from attaining that goal. But just knowing that means that you can start to find ways to work around it. You can click on the article for a little bit of advice and I would welcome anybody else's advice as to how to harness or work around their ADHD. And also tell me about any dreams or ambitions you have. Thank you so much for visiting. Bye.